Well, I can only focus apologetics on the big picture if I keep it in mind myself. And so many times what happens is, again, when you're in a dialogue situation or you're in a university, oftentimes people will try and misdirect you by taking you away. And it's by discipline and intent that you keep coming back. You know, we tend to, someone makes a leaf or a tree the issue when in fact the forest is the question. So we need to step out here. The question makes no sense. If I try to ask, answer a question down here at this level, I'm being tied up in knots about a moral decision. Like, for instance, what do you think about the gay question? And, you know, and because they want to position me as being anti-gay. And in the way this is being framed, it could be in a Marxist narrative, there are only two kinds of people in the universe, oppressed or oppressors. This works in the United States, the right and the wrong. So are you, if you give the wrong answer, you want, you're one of the oppressors or you're one of the wrong. There's only two options. They've removed the middle ground. But the way I would do that then in a, a situation like that, to go back to the big picture, is before we answer my view, because you're asking me particularly, or before I give any answer, can we ask first, how do we define what the good is? Because then if we go back to the question of the good, we have to have a dialogue about the nature of the good. And on the basis of what the good is, we will make a discussion. Now, they're going to tell me what they think is good. I am not going to accept their view of the good. They are not going to accept mine. Therefore, that is the issue, not my particular view on the, the moral or social issue they just gave to me. But if we haven't even got a first principle by which we can make any common denominator, then there's no basis for discussion. It's just rhetorical talent. If I answer too quickly, I'm in trouble. And if I get back, go down a layer to the, the bigger principle, we're on equal ground, and that's where the conversation needs to take place.